good afternoon in Sioux St. Marie, Michigan. If you notice, Argo has a little bit of a pep in his step. And we know, we know what that means. He did his trick. He found us not only a ship, he found us too. The close one here is the Canadian Steamship Line Welland. Um, previous video I had the St. Laurent, which has their goose painting on the superstructure. And this one, this is the other ship, it's a big painting on the superstructure. So, big old mural there. And behind them is the Saginaw. They're all hanging out waiting for their turn through the lock. Can't really see. I'm looking behind me. Ooh, sorry. The Algoma Mariner, I think, is just leaving the lock. So they, they need to wait their turn. You see how close the Welland is. They uh, <laughs> will obviously be next. There's no way a ship could get out of there going upbound. So and down below Big Point, or I guess technically above Big Point, <laughs> of Sherman Park, the John, the Munson is up there. So I won't get to see them, unfortunately. But I think I pointed out this little bit of construction previously. I'm still making good progress there. And that temporary structure they had over the winter, well, it's pretty much all the plastic is gone. And a lot of the uh, frame is gone too. I think it's all scaffolding. say one thing I really don't miss are the Harleys not that I'm anti-motorcycle I used to ride a motorcycle on the road for many years they're just obnoxiously loud yeah. of course the international bridge behind there vehicles you see coming from Canada over into Michigan. Yeah, kind of a nice, nice little view. Today is, I gotta do some math here, <laughs> the 10th. Oh, I'm, why did I have to do math? The 10th of April, 2024. So today, in fact, darn near almost to the hour, marks two years since I moved here to Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan. So I got here in the afternoon of April 10th. And I had to stay in a hotel that night so I could sign the papers from my house the following morning. Huh. There we go, two years. It hadn't dawned on me till about lunch and I was like, oh yeah, <laughs> that's why this day seems significant in my brain. Oh. So rather than blather on and on, I'm going to keep going here. So, hope you are having a great day. Uh, it's quite warm. It was 64 degrees here earlier. It's cooled down a little bit since the clouds came in. But 64 degrees today. That is the warmest day so far this year. Oh yeah, a little fair margin there. So, I can, uh, I can get used to it. <laughs> but we have rain, rain in the forecast for uh, Thursday and Friday. So, it's okay, we need it. But, that's gonna do it. So good job, Argo. Good job, Argo, yes. <laughs> 
And uh, yeah, we will, we'll be back, won't we, dog? Happy two years, dog. And he's not even acknowledging me. <laughs>